We're testing, testing. Okay, I see the sound wave bouncing around. So welcome back to part four of our video. Okay, now I'm so sorry. I have been very busy uh, the last week. Therefore, you know, you know, it's been a week's gap between the part three and the part four, right? So for those of you who are super hardworking, I'm so sorry, <laughs> been too busy, couldn't handle that, all right? Now, anyway, right? Now, what we are going to talk about in this particular video is one concept we call a uh, government expenditure, or as in your textbook at uh, page uh, 74, it's called public expenditure, okay? Well, what do you think about this book? Now, if you look at your textbook, page 74 to 75, actually not just 75, I think all the way to 77, okay, page 74 to page 77, right, you will see that and it talks about the current situation of the public expenditure of Hong Kong government, okay? Now, for those I'm going to not, not going to spend time in this video, okay? Now, because those you can read it on your own, right? Except one thing, okay? I actually want to look at the word public expenditure or for our purpose, government expenditure, okay? Now, I'm going to use something up. Please mark down. The word public expenditure is not quite the same as the CIG annex in our GDP. If you remember, in our GDP, G stands for something we call government consumption expenditure okay now this is very important it's government consumption expenditure okay g stands for this while when we talk about public expenditure government consumption expenditure is only part of public expenditure it's only the Okay, when we talk about public expenditure, as stated in textbook, we actually have other expenditure as well. Now, for example, for example, obviously, we have our G. Government consumption expenditure. For example, when we talk about civil servants, right, their wages will be part of the government consumption expenditure, right? Now, but then what else will be in public expenditure, but not in government consumption expenditure, right? For example, there is something we call government investment expenditure. Yeah. Okay, they can also buy bonds. Okay, one of the most important investment would be buying the sovereignty bonds of other country. China and US. Okay, basically, to build up a, a kind of what we call a diplomatic relationship, okay? Now, if you remember, when we buy bonds and stock, those are not counted in GDP because they have no production value, okay? But is it government expenditure? Yes. Okay, also another one, also very familiar, we call transfer payment. Okay, when you try to pay CSSA to the people in need, you are spending money. But remember, those are not government consumption expenditure. Now, so this is very small, okay? When we talk about total government expenditure, it's not quite the same as when we talk about government consumption expenditure, okay? Now, this concept is very important. Don't just write casually, I can't okay, la, no. Okay, don't be careful, be careful, be careful. Okay, how So, uh, just uh, look through the textbook at uh, these four pages on your own. Okay, not going to waste your time here. Actually, I want to spend more time on page seventy-eight and on, and uh, that would be page fourteen of your note. Okay, page fourteen of your note. Okay, how Actually, let's go right into our note. Okay, how Hold up now. Let's talk about the word budget. Budget in Chinese, yu soon. Okay, 好吗? So basically, government will put forth 
啊 plan for its income and expenditure， 究竟主要嘅 income 嚟自边度啊 ？Basically。Major income is taxation， 收税咯，主要咪嚟自收税咯，系咪 ？Expenditure，OK，、okay? we already talk about expenditure， not just government consumption expenditure， but also investment， transfer payment， etc. Right？ 好啦，有两样嘢要识嘅 ，OK？Wording，wording、okay? Wording matters，OK？、Okay? 好嘛 ？In the plan。OK， 我哋講緊計劃嘅時候 ，OK，in、okay? the plan，if we are planning income to be larger equal or smaller than the planned， 嗱、啊、小心啲啊，原來啦 ，when it comes to planned，we call it a surplus balance or a deficit budget、哎。誒，我哋將個 budget 放後面嘅字。呢個係個 plan， but when it actually turns out， 原來最後真係出嚟嗰個咧就好煩嘅，即係字係倒轉嘅。In the actual situation， we call it budget a surplus balance or deficit。OK， 得唔得？我哋唔係叫 planned something， 唔係叫 actual something。No no 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 no。OK， in the government plan before it happened。OK， we call it surplus budget， balanced budget， deficit budget。While when it turns out later， 我哋唔叫做 actual spending versus no 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 no。We call it budget surplus。Budget balance, budget deficit. Okay, so sometimes wording is a little bit clumsy. Okay, now obviously, for our purpose, this is the important part. You know, lah. Only when we talk about policies, okay, when we talk about uh, 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 the policy, right? How we can manipulate the、uh, economy, the performance of the economy, right? We are more concerned with how the government plan to do. Now, therefore, we are going to focus on surplus. Balance and deficit budget, okay? 好嘛，我哋讲个不诶，我哋讲系事前嘅 planning 啦 ，okay? 好嘛，嗱 ，we already talk about now. So what's the effects on macroeconomic performance, okay? Now when we spend a、uh, uh, government spending, right? Basically, when the government spend more, most of the time we know that GDP or for our ma、uh, for for our matter. Why would increase? 係咪我哋講嘅 output level 啊？係嘛 ？Why? Uh, it's a little bit difficult to pronounce. Why? W H Y. Why GDP and output level may increase? Maybe through several different uh, 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 different sources. For example, let's say government consumption expenditure can increase directly. 咁呢個識啦，係嘛 ？G 直接升，咁啊 C I G N 升咯。Okay. Now, also, maybe if we have more transfer payment, now, answer transfer payment. How much is output level? Ah, remember transfer payment more disposable income. Therefore, our C would increase. So, ah,、uh, AD would increase, right? Am I or Y increase? Am I? Or just ah investment. Okay, investment. Now, here. When we talk about investing more, most of the time,、uh, investing in stock and bonds, right? That would not affect,、uh, no major effects. Okay, 好嘛。所以啦，當我哋講緊啦 ，when government spending more money, be careful which part it is spending more. Maybe more government consumption expenditure, maybe more transfer payment. Okay, 得唔得？啊 ，or maybe if they say they have infrastructure, 係咪？佢話喂，我而家去搞嗰啲所謂 infrastructure 喎，係嘛 ？When we talk about Infrastructure, 政府起基建 So which part would increase? Basically, I would increase our fix a、uh, a、uh, gross a、uh, a、uh, domestic investment, right? Ah,、uh, a、uh, gross a、uh, yes investment investment expenditure. Okay, 得唔得？我哋讲 gross investment expenditure, real investment. Okay, 真系起基建啦 ，I 啦。So either way, when government spend money. Okay, when government spend money, you know either G increase, C increase, or I increase. Okay, either way, it's going to result in increase in economic performance. Okay, 好嘛？咁 of course, when they spend less, this would also hold true, right? 好啦 ，another one we call taxation. 好啦，收税又點影響咧 ？Major, uh, 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 most of the time, 
of course with taxation we know our output level will decrease why dim gaya most of the time most of the time we have less yd less yd so c decreases or right maybe for a company for example profit tax right we have less uh, uh, profit decrease now therefore we have less investment investment so you see these two are opposing force basically government expenditure would make y increase while taxation will make y decrease okay now therefore therefore so what exactly is a surplus budget well what is a surplus budget it means that government is getting more taxation okay uh, actually let's call deficit first now hong kong we keep saying uh, because of all the spending uh, the government expect that we'll have a deficit budget or they will take so i am deficit uh, we are talking about when the government spending is larger than the taxation right our spending larger than income now here boys very easy right when government spending increases it means that y would increase right this one uh, decrease the ultimate effects we know that y would increase Therefore, why one of the country, Basically, the US, why every year uh, US government keeps saying they have a, a chatty? A deficit, right? Basically, they want to boost the economy. Why Basically, to boost the economy. Therefore, you see on macroeconomic performance, right? Actually, output level would increase. Now, therefore, with this in mind, it's quite easy to understand the rest. When we talk about surplus budget, Basically, our spending would be less than our uh, income. Now, therefore, you see, right? Uh, now, this one, please write on the margin. We have something in mind, okay? Here, we know why would decrease. Well, then you got balanced budget, right? Basically, G equals to T. Therefore, our output level doesn't change, right? Easy, how can I? I wish you all come can tan so whole Okay, unfortunately, these three boxes only one of them is correct. That's a one year. Some got that got up. Yes, only one of the conclusion is correct. These two is actually not correct. Huh? Your man, mama, what's wrong? With this logic, can we go logic out, Mama? This logic is correct, except I miss out one very important factor. We have one very important factor that I missed out. Okay, let's see whether I have some uh, white paper. Yes, I missed out one. Very important assumption. Dana na la da ji shui xin. Oh, that is from my wife's school. Okay. Hey, ni da ji yo lu po ga ho ha. Wo si dan ne. Eh, yong ju xin ha. Mo lei la. Okay. Now, let's draw some. Uh, let's draw something together. Okay. Let's draw something together. Now let's see. Now. Before we can try to debunk our uh, false logic, okay, we need to first go back to the nature of taxation. 
before we can go back to the nature of taxation, we actually need to go back to the nature of consumption. Okay, let's start with a very simple example of Liu Chen. Okay, Liu Chen. Okay, we have Liu Chen. Let's say Liu Chen each month. Uh, the salary, for example, are uh, for simplicity simplicity sake. Let's say his income is hundred dollar. Well, you know, Liu Chen, every month Okay. Now, as a good practice, as you already know, well, sir, we won't spend consumption. We spend all the hundred dollar. Is it likely? Not quite. You know, my God. In reality, people would break down this income into two parts. You know, like who and learn part. Okay. The first part is what we call disposable income. For example, let's say Liu Chen uh, earning a hundred and then he decided that eighty dollar can be spent, for example, on McDonald's. McDonald's, McDonald's, the rest of it we call savings. Okay, you know, or they are true. In here, let's say we have twenty dollars. Of course, in reality, you know, 真实来说呢, we also have investment. Right? You know, the investment. For example, saving only $10, investment $10. Okay? Income would always be broken down into these. Okay? You know, they So, what does that mean, boys? A very important conclusion. Let's say if Liu Chen has $100 more income. Iga, let's say Miss Wong says, oh, let me increase your salary by a $100. Okay, you know, like, come on, Liu Chen, Gasan, Gaya Batman. What would be the important conclusion? It means that when it comes to consumption, the increase would be less than $100. You know, Ngo Gasan, Yap Batman. Consumption would be less effects on consumption. Okay? Namda. Now therefore, you see, the opposite is also true. Let's say, for example, because of taxation, now Liu Chen has 100 dollar less income. What does that mean? It means that the effect on consumption, obviously there will be less consumption, but probably the decrease would be less than 100. For example, in our case, only $80. You know, I'm going to Meaning, for those of you who already understand, when government spending increase by a hundred, most of the time, directly, output level would increase by a hundred. Most of the time, but most of the time, increase will be exactly by 100. While when tax decrease by 100, for example, the effects, you got a tax decrease, how many take why would increase? Okay, the effects on increase in why is actually less powerful. Okay, you know, yeah, the effects of G, okay, effect of G, government spending, 
in general is more powerful than the effects of taxation. Largely because of one concept, because of saving. Okay, 因为有储蓄啊 therefore the effect is not as powerful as directly spending by the government. 得唔得？嗱，呢个系好重要嘅 concept. This is an extremely important concept. Okay, if you don't understand this, my suggestion. Watch the video again, or WhatsApp me, call me directly. Do not proceed until you fully understand this concept. 嗱，好重要，一定要识，唔识嘅唔好继续落嚟，搞唔掂噶。Okay, now therefore, with this in mind, what I taught you, I actually faked you. 对唔住啊，原来阿 Sir 咧系困咗你嘅。Okay, 原来啊。The effects of government expenditure. Let's add one more arrow. It's actually more powerful than taxation. Okay, so here, this one is two increase, one decrease. Therefore, it must be increased. Hold up. If it is a balanced budget, what does that mean? It means that increase. In Y, here you see two arrows, right? One arrow down. What would be the overall effect? In fact, the overall effect is that output level would still increase because of the imbalanced effect on G versus T. Okay, 原來一個所謂 balance budget 仍然係會推動個經濟㗎。So the complication is actually here when it comes to a surplus budget. 好啦，就算我唔系赤字 ，OK. Now even government is getting more money. In fact, this is a big uncertainty because, yeah, 记住啦 ，the power of G is more powerful, more impactful. Here, Y decrease, but this one is smaller. 好啦。So we actually have a lot of cases. For example, here in case one, if the government spending is really a lot less than taxation, then even though the、uh, the incremental power of government spending is higher than taxation, then probably. Output level will still decrease. Okay. In another example, let's say G is a little bit, 係嘛？誒，佢仲係細過 taxation 嘅 ，but somehow the、uh, the the effect cancel out each other. Then no effect on output level. And in the final case, let's say it's just a little bit smaller than taxation. Then maybe we still have an incremental effect on output level. 嗱，所以好深噶呢个，特别 especially especially balanced budget. You need to be super ultra careful with this concept. Okay, 等等，嗱 ，boys again. My suggestion: if you don't quite understand this part, you need to watch the video again or WhatsApp. And、uh, call me directly so that I can explain to you again. With that said, let's look at one past paper example, and then we will end this particular video on by、uh, on budget. Okay, there is a very important question. Let's see where it is. Yes, this one. Let's go to page sixteen of your note. Okay, page sixteen of your note. Only one more. In page sixteen. Two thousand and eighteen, a sixteen. Question thirty-eight. This question was a cancelled question, but not because 
it is wrong. 唔係因為佢錯咗，所以 cancel 咗啊。This question was cancelled because even EAA messed up. 原來考評局自己本身唔識啊。OK. In 2016. Mr. Cliff Yuan, 有位補習名師叫做 Cliff Yuan. 誒、uh, ，he was the previous, okay, previous chief examiner, okay. He gave an explanation how this question, EAA mess up. 結果啦 ，EAA 睇咗啊 ，Mr. Cliff Yuan 講嘅嘢之後咧 ，they decided it is a question that even EAA cannot handle. 嗱，而家唔會再 cancel 噶啦。而家呢類題目咧，一定係知道答案噶啦。OK， 好嘛，好啦。It says. If the government simultaneously increase expenditure and income tax by the same amount, okay? 好啦，我哋望望啦。Here, simultaneous increase expenditure G increases income tax equals to the increase in income tax. Okay, G 升 T 升 Okay, the effect on Aggregate output. 我哋睇下有乜嘢 effect 啊 ？OK. In fact, EAA wanted the answer to be. 我哋頭先學咗啦，記唔記得 ？The effects of G on output level is larger than the effects on taxation. Therefore, supposedly, the answer should be C, right? Supposedly. Answer should be C. Uh, uh, by EAA. Okay, EAA 想話答案係 C 噶。But unfortunately, as we already learned, EAA miss out something. 係考評局都唔識啊。佢哋嗰陣時唔識，而家識噶啦，而家識噶啦。Okay, after this year, EAA knows this answer. Boys, let's recall income tax. 記唔記得 ？Income tax is a direct tax. Therefore, it cannot be shifted. 唔可以 shift 走佢嘅喎，即系啦，你做几勤力都 shift 唔走呢个 tax 啊。So when people know that when they work, they will get less money, what would happen? It will lead to something we call this incentive effect. 同埋我哋十七十八課都講過好多次啊 ，we call it disincentive effect 抑制作用啊。Okay, what does that mean? It means that people will、uh, will be less willing to work. Therefore, at least S R A S may decrease. 有機會跌㗎，有機會跌，唔一定 may decrease. It means that Y would decrease. 好啦 ，You see the boys here. Y increases. Y decreases. Does it increase or decrease? We don't know. 唔知啊。So the actual answer is indeterminate. 原來真正嘅答案係唔知先定啲啦。Of course, EAA that year they don't know. Therefore, they just cancel this question. 俾人鬧完之後啦，哎呀，冇得跌咗條題目好啲啦。Okay? 得唔得啊？嗱 ，of course, boys. Nowadays, this question will not be cancelled anymore. It's definitely D. 如果今年嚟講，如果而家嚟講咧，一定啲啦，唔會再 cancel 噶啦 ，EAA 識噶啦 ，they already know the answer。OK， 得唔得 ？So boys， for this particular video， all you need to if there is one thing you must remember， remember balanced budget。記住啦 ，the effect of G is larger than the effect of T。Therefore, even a balanced budget actually will still have something we call an expansionary effect. Why saying expansionary effect? Okay, 好嘛。Now, with that said, for the very next video is going to be a super super long video because we are going to look at policies. 係啦，我哋真係埋誒埋滿一腳睇曬嗰啲誒誒誒嗰啲誒誒 fiscal policy、monetary policy 啦。I think I will break it into two different videos, okay? One on the theory, one on the、uh, questions, okay? So brace yourself, take a good rest, and ready for the very next, the longest videos of this chapter. Okay, then see you in the next video. See you soon. Bye bye.